Okay, here we'll do the name Matthew in Descript. So, first let's look at this word. The double T with the H creates a bit of a problem. Now, this is a, an interesting problem. The T's tend to hang off of things, like an A it would hang off like so, an E it could hang off of like so, or like so in any way, and then connect to the next letter. They're like a joint. A double T is simply done by drawing a crossbar between the T. So, so this is E-T-T. So, now that we know that, we've also got the conflict of the TH. Now, the TH, this is a standard T, this is a standard H. You could connect them in the standard way, or you could rotate the T to the side, which gives you this form. This, you can chop this off, and this is reduced directly to this, creating the TH combination. So, how do we put TTH down on the table? Well, you have some choices. You could go TTH or you could go TTH. The thing about this that's tricky is you have to know ahead of time how you're going to write it. You have to plan two or three letters in advance. You can't write like standard English where you simply write one letter at a time. When you begin this letter, you will have to know in which way you're going to end the second or third letter up. Okay, so now let's see how we could draw the name Matthew. A simplest version would probably look something like this. M-A-T-T H E W. Now, where are our options for some improvement in design? Well, first of all, as I said, we could use the TH reduced version. Now, here's another interesting thing. The A can have a T added on the end of it, like so. So now this can be reduced to M A T T H. Now, this can be tricky to put these two together. So we've got another issue here. What we could do is we could add a double T at the end and extend a line down the middle. That normally would be an AH. If you're at all concerned about ambiguity, you simply add an extra dash to, it to make the H a very clear presence and whatever follows off here is separate. For example, if this was an N, the best would be to do that. However, if this was ATTN, this would probably be the best way to make it clear as it connects directly off of the final point. So, how can we draw the name Matthew? This one's particularly a little tricky. It's my own name as well, so I've had some fun with it. M-A-T-T-H-E. The E-W combination. It can be put in like that. Now, a W can also be drawn like this, simply by adding it into the word line, like a double R. So, we have many ways to end this. We can end this part like that. We can end it like this. We can end it like this. These lines can be skewed and pulled and stretched to any dimensions desired. So this, this bottom part here can be very aesthetically pleasing, and I like to use this as the top. Basically, you, with Descript, you br combine letters into combinations and forms, and then you try to put these together. It's basically the world's biggest alphabetical puzzle game. Great fun. Have some fun trying to create your own combinations with this.